Hey, it's Brock here with Rock Hill Farms, and I want to find out how good these chainsaw chaps really are. This is a cheap set of chaps, and I'm gonna find out if they will protect me from running this saw through them. Listen, listen, that's not a saw. That's a saw. <laughs> We're gonna test it out with these, man. All right, and uh, we really wanna know how safe it is, and We've got one really powerful saw and one electric saw, which I've heard can be even worse on chaps. So we're gonna try them both. Okay, we gotta flip a coin and see who's gonna wear these, man. Cause uh, I mean, I know we we're gonna do this, but I'm not wearing them. Well, I've got a double head coin well, that we can it. use. <laughs> <laughs> so, I, all right, and you've got tails. <laughs> yep. All right. Maybe we ought to put them on a tree or Maybe, something. Maybe, yeah, we're gonna put them on a tree. I, think, I don't think it's wise for us to do this with on us. Listen guys, we're playing here and this is fun, but you know, this is a, a real test. We're gonna actually test these, but you know, don't do something like this at home without some supervision from an adult. <laughs> My wife's here, so we're good. Yep. Brock's wife's here, so we're good. That was a pretty good lick. I've hit it pretty hard. Now was it was it still going or did it stop? No, no, it was still going. I mean, if you kept it on the leg, I'm pretty sure it would it would dig through. But that was probably a good. We'll put a timer on the video. That was probably a good two three seconds of full throttle, and it, it never stopped digging. And it tore these up, but we're not cut through the tree. We've got a nick there. I mean, it, I think it would have gave. I mean, the reality is probably. You're not gonna sit there a second. Right. You know, you're gonna you're, you're, you're gonna let go. And hopefully whoever's on the other side of you would too. But now I've seen some similar demonstrations to this with a homeowner size saw and have it completely stop it and they couldn't they couldn't get it to turn yeah. anymore. No, this this I turned this off. It it literally could it looked like it was gonna keep going. Yeah, it's digging. It's gonna take me an hour to clean this out, but <laughs> yeah. But uh I think it's worth it just to know. I it does make me feel a little bit better about the the, the chaps. Uh, because that this is 92 cc's of goodness, and uh, yeah, it this the torque it has is unreal. So that is an extreme to one end. Yep, and it would have saved your leg. It would. have. Like I said, all of that two three seconds, and actually only the poison ivy got a nick. Yeah, and actually it didn't go through it. It pulled it to the side where it did get it. Yeah, so it was actually pulling it away from me. I probably that was probably a really good test because. You know, most people would probably test this would go straight to the center. And that's the most protection. You really, you probably would go to the side. It probably, the accident's gonna happen to the side. Yeah. Well. You ready for the other one? I'm ready for the other. Batter up. I am curious about the, the electric because the electrics have a lot of low end torque. And that, that thing spins for a long time after you yeah. let off the trigger. I'd never ran that exact saw, but I was kind of surprised by that. So. That's, that is, 80 volts of, that's an 80 volt Atlas saw, uh, and it's it's stout. Uh, with a, with an 18 inch bar, I have no problem with putting it up against the gas saw, saw of equal equal size. And uh, it, so I have I, I have noticed though that the the electric saw has a lot more low end torque, whereas you, you on a gas powered you have a fade. You kind of you feel the power fading down. You don't feel, you feel when you touch the chain to the wood, you feel it pull. I've got a 60 volt DeWalt and without putting me in the wood, I can't say that, but it felt like that one might have more torque than mine. See how, see how long that coast? I think that's going to affect it. I just want you to know, man, that you're really handsome right there like that. I mean, that's, that is a picture. <laughs> there you go. That's it. I'm still, I never let go of the trigger. So it stopped that saw. It still, and it yanked. did not go through. It, did it get uh, any marks on the wood at all? I think that's probably a better test. It got one little piece of, right here. There's one little piece of bark that it hit. I mean, it would be just a tiny scratch. So I was, I did a but demonstration it, I, on the electric saw and I got a bunch of comments saying, be careful because your chaps won't stop that saw like they do your gas, but it sure did here. I, I will say this, because that saw is light, when you hung, it, I've seen it pull your arms. Where the big saw, there was so much weight 
on the saw, you know, it had it took a lot more to make it move forward. I felt the big saw kind of just kind of pull in. I seen you it when it hung, it 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 pulled. So I think it was a good test, and if if I had a takeaway from it, these do these will save your leg from absolutely. almost any saw. Yeah, is probably. I think we went to the extremes for sure. Yep. Um, I, I uh, yeah. I'm impressed. Actually, I am really impressed. It's not often that I'm surprised. I could have kind of thought this was going to just, you know, be right through and cut into the tree. Yeah, Especially I've, the big saw. I've never seen anyone test it on a saw that size. Yeah. that's These are these are all on Amazon. You can We'll put a link in the description if you're interested in them. We're not trying to sell them. But if you want to buy one, that's great. It helps the channel a little bit. But that's not what we did this. It was really a conversation between us and... And I think it's a, a ballot test. And chainsaw chaps are things, they only have one job, and that's to save your legs. So spending more on them, if the cheaper ones are going to save your leg, then there's no point. But. Yeah, I, I, uh, I have to get another pair now. Yeah, <laughs> those were his, so I think I, I owe him now. But if you guys haven't already seen it, probably most of you have, but be sure to check out Tony's channel. They've got, they do all kinds of fun stuff on there. This has Anything been pretty fun, though. outside, yeah. So we appreciate you taking time to watch, and we'll see you on the next one. Be safe out there.